Hi guys, so this is take two of the ice fishing because the first ice fishing experiment did not work well for us, but Mrs. Meckley forgot one step. So she had to go back and reread the directions to see what she did wrong, and I figured it out. So let's see if this time will work for us. I'm going to drop down the computer so you guys can see my container. This time, remember to put your string in the bowl first and then put the water on it. This is the step I forgot to do. Your string has to be wet. Okay, there you go. So now you put ice cubes in. You can put as many or as few ice cubes in there as you want. I think I'm going to put four ice cubes. Let's count. One, One two, three, three four. four. So four ice cube. Now we're going to take our string that is wet and put them on the ice cubes. Now we are going to take a lid that has salt on it and we are going to sprinkle the salt over the string that is setting on your ice cube. Okay, so the salt, wait a minute, don't touch yet. The salt melts the ice and then it refreezes on the string. So we needed to let it set for about 20 seconds. So we're gonna count to 30 just to make sure we have enough. Okay, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Great counting, guys. Catherine is going to lift up the ice cube slowly and see how many we catch. 1, 2, 3. This one is stuck. Oh, and this one's stuck. This fish does not want to come out. So we caught four fish. 1, 2, 3, 4. Very good. Let's set it down. Let me know how many ice fish you guys have caught. Remember to wet your string because that is very crucial to this experiment. I did it without wetting the string and it I caught zero fish. So have fun. Bye, guys.